117 steals. He's been cut down 39 times, which that, too, is a record set many years ago by the great Georgia Peach Tyrus Raymond Cobb. There he goes! And the throw down, and the... Oh! He's real safe, number 118 for Anderson. The crowd, although they have signs up here for Ricky, are booing the call. They had the clean pickoff. Let's look at it again. Nelly, look at this one real close. Caldwell, with a little deceptive move, quickly throws the first. But Henderson was already off and flying. The tag appears to be high on the rear end of Henderson. His arm sneaked in ahead of the tag. Now, keep in mind also that Derwood Merrill is the umpire that called Henderson out in Oakland two nights ago. The tag applied high, his hand in ahead. Ties the record at number 118, a standing ovation for Ricky Henderson. Ricky's not going to get a big lead. He's going to have, if he goes, he's going to have to do it with sheer speed because Liriano is going to keep him close. There are two outs. Liriano ducks in. Ricky's going. Pitch is high. He stole it. The American League record for Ricky Henderson. went to his mother 893 is going to Tom Treblehorn his first manager there is Bobby Henderson how ironic he would do it at third base where his good friend Kelly Gruber is right the man he had the rhubarb with <laughs> in the American League Championship Series Tony LaRussa out to congratulate his man. You know, we're going to have a brief ceremony. As there it is. 893. Well, that really 893. is remarkable. Is that ever? And here it is again, the historic stolen base. And he took third base. Watch him go. Boy, he's in full bore right now. He's watching the play. I know Ricky, he'd rather have had a throw there. And he, he beat Kelly Gruber to the right. base. Exactly. And he ripped it right up. Lou Brock sits over there behind the dugout looking on. Ricky with 937 steals. Now to the belt. And the pitch. He's running. Pitch taken. Perry Stroh. Ricky has removed second base, patted it lovingly, raises both arms to the crowd. Listen. having come from behind a three a one nothing deficit Ricky goes a pitch ticket he's gonna have it he does Ricky Henderson no contest steals third base jerks the bag from its moorings and holds it aloft representing number 939 Ricky pounds it with his left fist hands it to equipment manager Frank Sinchek who gives him a big hug there's Ricky's mom. Again, talking about the uh, game <laughs> being forgotten. <laughs> and Lou Brock, probably the happiest guy on the field right now. He can finally make his speech, pass over the record to Ricky, and go about his business. 
It really helps the hitters when Ricky is in this situation because the infielders have like Trammell. He can't play a normal position. Here he goes. Pitch is inside. Tettle and throw. And he is in safely with number 1,000. Well, the fans recognizing the milestone that Ricky Henderson has just reached. He wants the base. Can't blame him for that. Of course, uh, we'll have to charge him for it. He can have it, but uh, we'll have to charge him about it. What do those go for? 100 bucks or something like that? He Sorry, Ricky, it. but fork it up. He can afford it. It was third base that Ricky stole when he broke Brock's record. Got a great jump. It wasn't even a close play. Thought Ricky might wait until the situation was a little bit different, but he took off. It was a good high fast pitch on the inside part to Tettleton. Tettleton makes a good throw. Ricky just gets a great jump. Mike Aldretti now. And Ricky's running on the first pitch. A throw by Ron Karkabice is not in time. Ricky has stolen the base. 1,066. And Ricky said he was going to present the bag when the steal came to Fukumoto. He has already pulled up the bag from its moorings. A new one is being put in his place. Ricky's walking across the left side of the diamond to bring it to Frank Sinchak, the A's equipment manager. There was a ceremony between the game involving Ricky and Yutaka Fukumoto, in which the uh, Japanese star presented Ricky with a pair of gold spikes. 